The Porphyry involves uh, a number of role players, which you would have seen today. Uh, the very first person to perform a visible and audible act is the Kaikranga, so the lady who uh, delivered a call of welcome, which was responded to, usually by another lady, but in some uh, situations a man who will respond with what's known as a waiter. The people come in, there's then a, a, a prayer that's, that's, that's delivered, a very brief prayer, and then the oratory starts, the whaikōrero starts, the, the, the speeches if you like, echoing again the sentiments which were echoed in the kranga, that of, of welcome and um, of, of peace and of grace. I think it's a really nice way to welcome new students and make them feel part of a family. I had never really been to Amara, so it was a very nice new cultural experience of New Zealand. Yeah, it was like interesting. I haven't been to one before, and the food afterwards was nice. So. Yeah, I haven't been to one before either, so it's a very interesting experience. My favourite part of Orientation Day is probably the uni guides. They're real helpful. Probably meeting all the new students and making new um, contacts and getting to know everyone and helping them to settle in. Getting to meet new people and getting to know um, different people are doing different subjects. Um, I've learnt where everything was. I was completely lost before. It felt like a massive family being welcomed into the university. Oh yeah, it's just a whole great day of fun, you know, meeting new people, helping people settle in. The university is a huge place, so the program we're running is you know, a great way to make new friends and meet new people.